Hi friends. You might have noticed lately some people wearing masks that cover this part of their face, their nose and their mouth, so you can't really see what their mouth is doing. I have one right here that my daughter made me that I'm going to put on in a minute. But I want to show you something first. I was wondering if you knew that you can tell how a person is feeling just by looking at their eyes. It's true. Watch this. I'm going to bring the camera a little bit closer so you can see what I'm drawing here. I have five faces. I'm going to give all of these little faces some ears like that. And I'm going to give them a little bit of hair. Nothing fancy. Just so you can tell. This is the top of their head. Where the hair goes. Like that. Okay. Now, first face I'm going to draw. I'm going to put two eyes. And I'm going to make their eyebrows look like this. Just kind of straight, pointy, uppy. Yeah, I'm not trying anything else on that face. Okay. Now, I'm going to draw one that looks like this. Mm-hmm. All you can see are the eyes. And now I'm going to draw one. Two eyes like this. And then kind of... Kind of eyebrows that are way up high. Then I'm going to draw another one. Like this. With... Oh, yeah. Kind of like this. Eyebrows that are pointing like that. Yep. And the last one I'm going to draw is like this. And um, these I'm going to kind of make like this. Kind of pointing down and squig a little more squiggly. Kind of like that. Hmm. Well, now let's add the mouth and the no and the nose and see if you can guess before I do that how this person is feeling. If you guessed mad, you would be right. You can tell that even before I drew the nose and the mouth. If you guess, take a look at this one. If you guessed sleepy, you would be right. You can tell that person is sleepy. If, let's look at this one. If you guessed, I'm going to give him a great big happy smile. If you guessed happy, the person with the eyebrows up real high, you can tell, um, that face is happy. If you, let's look at this one. Hmm, these two are a little tricky. If you guessed, let's see, let's give him a frown. Yeah, if you guessed sad for that guy with those kind of eyebrows, you'd be right. He was sad. Now, this is almost the same, just more squiggly type eyebrows. This one, I think, looks a little worried. Yeah. And you can almost tell that without even seeing the mouth and the nose. Well, I want to. I'm going to pull the camera down again. And we're going to play a game to see if you can guess how I am feeling when I put my mask on without even seeing my nose or my mouth. All right, let's do this. Yeah, my daughter Alyssa made me this mask. It's really pretty. It's got some purpley type flowers on it. I'm gonna hook it over my ears. I know what you're thinking. Whoa, Mrs. Dion. 
you look really different. And I do. This kind of a mask is one that I wear when I go to the grocery store. I don't want to give other people germs and I don't want to get anybody else's germs. So that's why people are wearing them. Now, I'm going to make a, a face and I want you to try and guess how I am feeling. You ready? If you guessed happy, you would be right. You can tell without even seeing my mouth. Good. All right, you ready? Let's do another one. Take a look at that. Mm-hmm. If you guessed mad, yep, you would be right. That's a mad face. All right, let's do another one. Ready? If you guess sleepy, you're right. <laughs> That's sleepy. Let's do another one. All right, let's see. Um, if you guessed surprised, you would be right. Let's do one more. If you guessed worried, mm -hmm, you would be right. All of those different faces you guessed without even seeing what my nose or my mouth were doing. If you want to try playing this game with someone in your family, you could use, if you have a mask at home, this is a mask I use when I'm doing um, woodworking so I don't get sawdust in my mouth. This was long before there was anything happening out there. Yeah, it's just a white one that looks like this and you can kind of pinch it. You might have something like that. Your dad might have a woodworking mask at home. Um, or you can even just do this. Cover your nose and your mouth with a piece of paper and make a face and see if the other person playing with you can guess what you are feeling. Try it. Have fun.